of the Fashion Diaries. So today, I am off to see the brand Relight. It's an online retailer who resell clothes. So I've actually worn a, a couple of their items before. The first one I wore was to a red carpet. My stylist styled me in that. He went to go see them and absolutely loved the outfit. He was telling me all about this brand. Um, and then I actually kept another dress for when I went on a holiday because it was just absolutely stunning. I'm really excited to meet them. They've apparently got me a little rack of clothing together to try on, of clothes and shoes. Um, so yeah, excited to go. We're gonna head there now. It's about an hour and 15 minute drive. Um, we'll go meet the team at Reliked. just arrived we've just seen the offices um you can see a lot of parcels of bags what i've seen a lot of bags of clothes in here <laughs> through the window um i've actually brought two big bags of clothes with me to give them as obviously it is a second hand seller um and i believe they make like a little page if it's like where people will be able to shop on a milli page and it will have all the clothes that i've given to them so i'm gonna carry that with me they're very big um and we're gonna go in and see them now i'm very excited size of this bag <laughs> oh no it's huge it's actually ridiculous got a ring doorbell and everything it's gold why do i not have a gold one hi <laughs> millie how are you yeah, I'm fine. Oh. Oh. Hi. Go around all the around those. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! What's this? Is it a girl boy? Boy, friend. Yes. Friend, how are ya? Oh my god, how old is he? Is that uh, a puppy? Seven or eight months, yeah. Six months. Oh my god, look at him. Shall I just leave my bags there? Is that yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna actually just leave this there as well. So we're gonna go to the warehouse and see what clothes I have. <laughs> oh, the doggy's coming, you're coming too, are you, Frank? Oh. Oh, wow. <gasps> oh no! I have so much stuff. It's very empty because we had a really good Black Friday. Oh, oh did you? So it's normally rammed. This wow, is, this is huge though. This yeah. is not empty at all. Mm. So this is just High Street. And oh, okay. Fashion. Yeah. So that's yeah. and it's all filed in week order. So what when do you mean gets, in week order? So when it gets listed onto the site, yeah. that's the week number. Oh, okay. Because after three, just over three months, Fast Fashion will, if it doesn't sell. We we'll oh. get donated, so we donate to Bernardo's, we donate to Smart Works if there's any interview kind of appropriate stuff. I and bet. that's really good because yeah. that's actually something we was going to ask is what actually does it have a lifespan? Yeah. What about luxury then? Luxury that stays on the side forever it until yeah. it gets sold and or until it's wanted back. Oh, so, yeah. it, it isn't often wanted. Oh, back. right. So if say I gave you a luxury item and then it didn't sell for months and months, you just get back to me. We'll leave it on for as long as, as I want it. As yeah, you want to, but if not, yeah. It'll get reduced periodically yeah. to try and shift it. Oh, right. Okay. So you do beauty as well? Yeah, we, we sell beauty because obviously if a beauty blogger gets sent six or seven different foundations, yeah. they may only use one or two oh, and then cool. they'll give us the rest and we sell it for really discounted prices. The beauty, what about jewellery? Yeah, everything. Do Literally uh, everything. Yeah, ev basically everything. And fashion and beauty. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, We've yeah. even got some homeware for our. Oh! Because <laughs> I've only bought clothes, so I could have. Yeah. I should really. Well, next time I like go for all my shirt shoes. I have so much makeup as well because I get sent lots of makeup and I don't yeah. use it all. And it's a shame for it to go to Yeah. Waste. And anything that doesn't sell within that time frame in beauty gets donated to the Women's Aid Refuge at the top of High Wycombe, which is lovely because oh, nice. quite often those ladies have to leave in the middle of the night with nothing. So it's nice to donate. Oh, that's really good. I know we've started to sort of explore that more because I will admit, like I've, I've always just thought of pre-loved as being like 
not very nice, mm. like clothing, like people give away like stuff that they don't want and it's, it's, they've had it for like years. But now I'm in an industry where I wear clothes a lot and then probably only once because it's for a photo shoot or an event. I'm like, well, what do I do with this now? And I'm sitting on so much stuff that isn't probably going to be used. So I want to give it to people, but I also want to make sure that I'm what, shopping pre love too. Yeah, no, that's really great. Like it's so, like that, those two dresses that I wore from here, beautiful dresses, I'd never even think that they were second hand. No, that's why we set up basically to be exclusive for celebrities and influencers. Yeah. Because it's really nice. That's why it's called Reliked as well. So yeah. you've seen it, someone's seen it on you so and true. liked it on yeah. Instagram, and now they can rewear and reuse it and relike it. So oh, I like that. That's how, oh, that's how the name came about. So do you have um, like quite a lot of influencers who give to you then? We've got over five hundred now. Oh wow! Yeah, we started with one, and oh. yeah. Now what? So the actual business started because one influencer gave to you. Is that yeah. how the idea came about? Yeah, my um, daughter, who you've met earlier, yeah. her best friend, well, not her best friend, one of her friends was yeah. Sarah Ashcroft. Oh. And I started to work for Sarah, selling her items on eBay and Depop. And it, I just thought, she gets so much stuff. And obviously, you guys have a higher turnover of clothes. Yeah. So it's great to give them back to your followers at discounted prices. So true. Do you know how many requests I get from people? I get random messages and someone's like, I love this outfit you were wearing. Is there any chance you've still got it? And like selling it. Or like, do you have a thrifted page? Like, I don't know whether many of my followers know about Relight. So I think that's why I'm like, Go on there because oh, just thrifted, thrifted has designed like luxury stuff too, mm -hmm. yeah. But people, I just want to show a bit more awareness. It's not just like you got thrifted, where else do you have? Really, well, like, Depop, oh, Depop, eBay, I suppose, yeah. Oh, yeah, eBay. Vinted. Vintage, Vintage. Yeah. so it's quite a lot, isn't there? Mm. So it's quite good that you've managed to like it's establish a little niche yourself as well, yeah, yeah with just influencers. Yeah. So everything on there is only influencer stuff. Do you yes. have like you know, we've got influence. yeah, we have some TV stylists that give oh, to okay. us. But again, it's been worn by celebrities, so it's still we class that. It's like yeah. it literally like a celebrity mm. reworn platform. Yeah. Oh, I didn't know that. <laughs> That's really interesting. Okay, let's have a look. Monday, I think we've got these lovely <gasps> books. No way. Uh, they literally sold within one minute. Oh my god! Oh, oh, I've got the so bits. I love them. Yeah. I've got the, well, the got pink hey, one. I've got the pink one, yeah. and we've got them in my yeah. yes, I saw oh, that. Uh, yeah, pictures. How do you like? Okay, so people literally do. I wonder why someone wouldn't want them. But do you know what I mean? Mm. They're really like trendy at the moment. Yeah, maybe they're changing their colour scheme. For True. Yeah. yeah. This is all inbound. Yeah. So yeah. All um, been collected recently from our clients. On like a time frame, like how how long has this been built up? Is this is this... only a month. So. Only a month. <laughs> Do you get deliveries every day? Yeah, so Guy, my husband, he's a collection oh, driver, he's yes. upstairs. Um, he'll um, do a route oh, and go and collect it all. Sure. Uh, sort of oh. one hour time window. Wow. So it's a very VIP service for our VIPs. Uh, I remember because Jeff, my oh, yeah, yeah. who came to you, he um, was the one who got me those dresses and he said, oh, they're like really interested in getting your, your page on, like your stuff. Yeah, and I was like, they'll come amazing. and collect it. Yeah. And I was like, oh, really? It's really good. <laughs> I haven't even got a move. <laughs> Claire, she's packing orders as well. Hi, Claire. Hi, I'm Millie. Oh, this is the beauty section. Oh, okay. This is Georgia. Hi, Hi Georgia. Georgia. I'm Millie. <laughs> luxury starts. Oh, this is all the luxury. <gasps> What's the um, most expensive luxury item you've had, oh, can you think? Like, is it a bag, maybe? Do you get bags? Yes, like so bags? yeah, we've just sold oh, the £5,000 Chanel bag. No way! Yeah, so that went out yesterday. Oh, Can you say who gave that to you? Yeah, the fashion oh, blog, blog, Laura Wills. Wow! Yeah. Oh, oh, £5,000 Chanel. What colour was it? It was like a black and gold tweed. You know the maxi? Oh, see, it was really beautiful. Beautiful. Yeah. And was it in like, like really Pristine good box. condition? The seats, everything, yeah. I don't think I could give away my handbags. <laughs> like they're like, especially like in this year of my life where I've sort of like treated myself and I feel like I've got like a connection with them now. 
I don't think I can sell them, maybe not just yet, maybe when it maybe builds up a bit more, but... <laughs> this is, um, I've got two of these machines, they're like state-of-the-art style sheets machines. Oh, oh, they're yeah. They're so cool. Look at that, right? And this is um, Will and Ben. Hi, hi nice Will, hi Ben, I'm Millie. Nice, nice to meet you. Oh, wow. so this is where you do the photography? Yeah, oh, so okay. that's really cool. Bill and Will. Bill. Bill and Will. <laughs> and Will are doing apprenticeships with us, so... Yeah. Ah! What is all this is that lighting and where's the cameras? Oh, is it the cameras there. Oh my god, I'm getting in the way. No, then. it's alright, it's, it's not taken, it's the photo's been taken, so that's the photo now. Right. And I have seen though that sometimes pictures of the influencers in them, yeah, if, if you can, can that, yeah, that's amazing. If it's it really on their helps, Instagram, yeah. I suppose. But then you do this if they haven't got a picture. Yeah, that's really pretty. That top, isn't it? Look at that dress. But that's high, a high quality of our items are on new tags. Yeah, I've got a lot of stuff I'm giving you. It's new yeah. tags. Oh my god, that's stunning. Yeah, that is. Nice. Look at this, right? It's forever unique. I love forever unique. Put the sleeves. Yeah, that's, that's beautiful. a bit of me, isn't it? How did that, like you start it all then? Well, I had one influencer that was a friend of my daughter's and yes. I started it from my bedroom and then eventually got another couple and had to move from the big bedroom in the house. <laughs> we moved into the small bedroom and no took over the big bedroom. Then we moved to a yellow storage, then we moved to a converted pub and then we found this um, building which is literally perfect and it's five minutes from all of our front doors we all live there. Oh you all yeah. live around here that's nice. So it's, yeah it's been brilliant. Oh my god you start from your bedroom. Isn't it mad how like you just get an idea you probably didn't think it was going to be as big as this and now you've actually got like the massive brands. Yeah no it's great it really is good oh. and I just feel like we're doing really positive things with it. We're exactly. Donating unwanted items to charity we're making money for charity mm. we're giving clothing a second life it's fantastic. That is fantastic I do think that the world is moving in a way where like people want to give and people don't want to buy fast fashion as much as more. I do feel like it's going to end up being more so, maybe not more, like fast fashion is obviously going to be yeah, around. Yeah, and it is needed. Not everyone has the budget no. for expensive items. So exactly. even to be giving fast fashion a second and third life is Yeah. Worth. So do you sell more fast fashion or more luxury? It used to be more fast fashion, but it's it's sort of getting no. nearer 50-50 now. Oh, wow, really? Yeah. Well, I've just spotted the coat, the diesel coat. We was having a look through your website. <laughs> look there, isn't that it? I literally can't see what you're pointing at. Oh, yeah, that. Yeah! Oh, my gosh. It's amazing. How sick is that? I love diesel. Got to try that on. Oh, yeah. I actually might have to try it on. Yeah. I don't know whether this is going to this outfit, though. That is so that. cool. That is that's cool, wouldn't it? Really is there a mirror up here now? Yeah, I mean, it, it suits your hair. Like, do, do it, it up. Yeah. Try it, Janet. This is like high fashion. It's not very wearable so every day, cute. though, is it? I think it's a vibe. I would wear that every day. It's yeah, cute coat. Why not? Yeah. Like pair leggings and just chilling over a tracksuit. Chunky trainers or Bottega <laughs> boots. What about? I would have a look. Hello. 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 Oh, look at this. What's this? It's the big one. This is our content. Oh, cute. Oh, this is the right one. Yeah. yeah. But obviously, oh, we just bought some like glam pieces. Yeah. And then if you want to go through and like pick any other bits and whatnot. Did you go through my Instagram and see my style? Yeah. Yeah. This looks very me. I was just walking looking through it and I was like, right, this did Yeah. I'm loving the sparkles and the feathers. Yeah. I love what you mean. It suits the bob. Yeah, it suits your hair. I don't know why. I think, yeah, it was the collar, yeah. It's very cool. I feel like I would struggle, like, trying to pair it and stuff, though. It's neutral. It goes into everything. Statement piece, though, isn't it? It's amazing. It's like you, I just probably, probably wouldn't wear it with black, I'd probably wear it with a white top. No, I, do you not I like that. that. I like you it like exactly it what you're wearing. Yeah. And I think it goes with the denim as well. So I don't like it with what I'm wearing. I don't know why. Okay, I'm gravitating first towards this. This is from Clabelle, actually. That is so cute, I'm just obsessed with that. Okay, so I love the look of this already and there's one behind it which is very Hayley Bieber style with the like, like thong, fake thongy detail. And this, this looks stunning. Well, guys, I wore blue uh, in Chamonix, didn't I? And everyone was like, blue, this is so good on you. Blue suits Blue is a good yeah. colour for blondes, it is. 
when I was looking at the Met Gala um, outfits yesterday, I, I feel like brunettes look really nice in red. If you've actually got like dark brown hair, like really nice. And blondes suit blue for some reason, so I'll definitely try that on. Um, Shannon from my series of Love Island actually wore this, and Emily was like, oh my god, I love this dress. So, <laughs> Emily, you trying this one on? A lot of you have probably seen these before. They're like the classic chainmail, backless, like skimpy, really cute dresses. Um, gold and silver. I've worn the silver one before, but I think I'm actually going to try the gold one on because I'm a gold gal. So this dress RRP is for 250. Relikes are selling it for 95, which is 62% off. So literally more than half the price, which is unreal, and it's literally in perfect condition. Talking on behalf of some influencers, then I do believe that this probably was only worn once, let's be real. It's a very statement piece. I can't imagine an influencer wearing this to two different events if they've been pictured in it. So, we were just having a chat earlier. If it's only been worn once, sometimes it can be just worn for a picture. I've been guilty of it, like with my job, I take pictures and post it on Instagram and then never wear it again. So, what better way to use it by giving it to relight and then someone else gets to have it. So I'm gonna try something else on now. What should we go for now? Oh my god, you found the pink dress. Oh my god, it's beautiful. That is actually so stunning. I'm really obsessed with that. Wow. It's glistening, isn't it? I need to put heels on. I'm gonna put some silver heels on. Just so you can see what it looks like. Probably wouldn't, I'd probably wear a cropped top just because you can sort of see it come in. There's, I think there's meant to be a nice little gap there. But this is a poster girl skirt. So it's on, oh no, sorry. RRP is 485 and it's on Reliked for 199. So it's actually got 52% off, 59% off, sorry, not 52, 59. And, oh my God, I just really love it. Okay, then these heels, we've got the little lipsy heels. I'm not a massive fan of circle toe. I do like a square toe, but just so you can see sort of the whole fit. And then this bag, I mean, I'm obsessed with this bag. What's this brand? Ella Lingi. This bag is retailing for six nine five, and actually is on the website for 297, which is 60% 60, 60 off. <laughs> That's fine. I can't remember numbers that quickly. There's big numbers. <laughs> Love it, guys. Really, really nice. What do we try on next? What's Bawa then? I've never heard yeah, of Bawa. We get quite a lot of their stuff in. That's, that's Jess Hunt. Is it? So she gets a lot. I feel like they're quite they're quite similar to Naked, like just kind of beigey, simple, like timeless pieces. Is Bawa strand or something? Or is it just oh, big, like the OA? I don't never heard of it. No, I've never heard of yeah, that. I come from I love so that many brands I yeah. actually didn't hear of. And I know. Like, um, 130 RRP of that. I'm actually just gonna put that over my shoulders for now. <laughs> we have this trench coat which is like a cream leather from Bubba. So we're just finding 78, so RRP is at 130 and we uh, really like selling it for 78, brand new with tag. So that's why it's probably less discount because it's literally never been worn. It's literally got the tag in it guys, right here. So yeah, brand new obviously means that it will be a little bit no, a le less discount, but obviously because it's brand new. And then I love this one. Okay, so we actually wanted to try on something that isn't something that I would probably wear, but a lot of my followers did say they wanted to see like outfits and clothing that isn't just my style, because this might be your thing. I mean, look how absolutely beautiful this is though. Like, personally me, I wouldn't wear this to somewhere, but it's perfect for a prom or a formal. So guys, any of my young gut viewers, if you're watching this, they have all this kind of stuff on the website. So you can even find your prom dress on there. So this is actually being sold, well, RRP is 520. On the site, it's 199, and that is 62% off. So, I mean, how beautiful. I literally feel like a princess. With bag of stuff right here. And I'm gonna hand it over. This is all, I've got two bags actually, but 
hands in. You hang it up and then just talk us a little bit about the process. Yeah, of course. So basically what we're going to do with all of your stuff, we're just going to check through all of it, make sure it's all suitable. I'm sure it will oh, be. Oh, okay. Um, what, if it's got stains and stuff? Yeah, so if there's any like makeup marks yeah. and stuff like that, we'll just go through it and then we usually send it up to prep and then it gets listed by some of our listing team. Yeah. And then it comes up for photos just to make sure that we're getting a full view of the actual product mm. so everyone can clearly see what they're buying. Yeah. And then it will just be on the website and stuff like that and we go so from there. If there is makeup or stains, what happens? Well, sometimes we'll try and get it off depending on how stubborn the oh, mark can be. Yeah. Sometimes it will be a tiny flaw, so it's just yeah. something that we want to let our like buyers know. Yeah. So they don't have to kind of like come back and forth to us. Kind yeah, because otherwise they might complain. Like, yeah, oh, exactly. Something. What about if like it's a re it, what, like, I don't know. Say I had a sample and it's not like. It hasn't got an RRP. We usually just look into like researching, so we'll have yeah. a look into something that we can find that's really similar, or we'll contact you and be like, do you know roughly how much this is going to cost? Okay. And stuff you. like that, just so we've yeah, got more yeah. of an idea, so we're giving like a clear price and we can work from there. Yeah. Obviously, once we've, well, we've hung this up, taken pictures, logged it all, what happens then at the end? So it basically goes on to our website, we'll create a page under your name, and okay. then we'll contact you and let you know that it's available and live and then you'll promote it and then we'll promote it as well so then That's your followers true. can shop it on yeah. every kind of thing so we have an app as well and a website so oh, they can okay oh, i need to get the app i don't actually have the app yeah it's really good at the moment if you download it you get 20 percent off your first shop oh yeah which That's is really good? good yeah we've just done it up so it's a really good thing to have a look <gasps> on oh this is little memory of our first trip in paris Guys, I don't know if you remember this picture of me wearing this dress in Paris. I'm not gonna wear it again. So if you want this dress, there's only one, okay? It's gonna be on really like, so keep your eyes out. <laughs> right, second bag. Let's hang this up. Oh, I love this. Oh, wow. oh, this is beautiful. Guys, another dress that I wore in Paris. This is from uh, Forever Unique. Oh, it's beautiful. I'm really sad that I'm letting that one go, but it will go to you. a better home. Someone who will really enjoy that. It's Hassi B. I wore it in Thailand. It's really pretty. So anyone who's got a holiday coming up in the summer wants a little cute pink cord, go on my shop. And that's it. Oh my God. This is my very first collection and it'll be available to shop on Reliked very, very soon. What you're doing is amazing. Oh, thank you. Remember what you're doing is amazing. <laughs> <laughs> no, really happy to be here. I'm, I'm excited for this to go live now as well. Yeah, we're really excited. I feel like my followers are going to be really excited about this. Yeah. Day. So that is the end of our little trip to visit Reliked. I just want to say thank you so much, guys, for letting me come and film and talk to you guys. It's been really interesting to find out loads more about the brand. Because as I said before, I'm not sure whether many people or my followers anyway who know about Relight, so that's why I wanted to do this, you know a little bit more about secondhand, well let's not say secondhand, we don't like that word, I like pre-loved, we all like pre-loved, pre-loved clothing, pre-loved luxury clothing, handbags, jewellery and beauty, like you have everything on this website, so yeah, thanks again for having me and don't forget that my collection with Relight, all of my lovely clothes it's gonna go to a lovely new home a second home and obviously you guys it's going it's pretty loved that's what this is all about so yeah thanks for having me see you later bye. Thank you. bye is there anything about today that surprised you i was quite surprised at how how much clothes they had in their warehouse and also how many influencers and also I actually didn't realise that they only did influencers or celebrities. Yeah, I thought it was like anyone could give to them but it's not, it's actually a pure, purely online re retailer, reseller for influencers clothes. So if there's any of your favourite influencers um, that you love, have a look on their influencer list because there might be someone on there who you follow, love their style and they're selling their stuff. So you might as well get on that. Like it's a really good thing. Okay, so that's it for this episode. I will see you guys in the next one.